Well, maybe you want to go out to eat this weekend or for Valentine's Day. Come on over. This is Paolo from Fajita Republic. Best fajitas I've ever had. Great to see you. Nice to see you. Wonderful Mexican restaurant in, uh, in Green Bay, on the east side of Green Bay. And a little different from a lot of Mexican restaurants because you really pride yourself on doing um, fresh, 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 you know. Made from scratch, most of it. From in scratch, yep. yeah, yep. exactly. And you'll find, you know, a lot of your Mexican favorites, but you'll also find some unusual dishes, lots of dishes with seafood. I know we have Lent coming up, and that's a big thing. Uh, people, you know, not eating meat on Fridays and want to do something other than a fish fry after a while, you know? And people don't know that uh, Mexican restaurants have a seafood already option. And uh, in our restaurant, we have over 13 options or seafood dishes that you can come and, and try. Friday, Wednesday, or any time. Oh, really? Always are, on the menu. They are always on the menu. Not just a Lent thing. So not just a Lent thing. This is a fun thing. Very romantic for Valentine's Day. Also great for, for Lent. Um, it's very in. I think it's very on trend right now is uh, ceviche. What is ceviche. it? Ceviche is, is, uh, is raw fish that you marinate with, uh, with uh, fresh lime juice. And you add uh, uh, cilantro, cilantro, onions, tomato. And, and then you, you can eat them with crackers or chips. Or, or by, by itself, and it's a very healthy dish. It's a nice light appetizer. It's a great way to kind of get the party started. Um, uh, uh, Paolo's got it presented here in a really pretty margarita glass. So it's just a fun, different thing to do. So, all right, let's let's make one. And always on the menu. At always in the menu. Republic, do you sell a lot of them? Yeah, we do. Mm -hmm. We do. So people start with a with a light appetizer, and then they they go with the chimichangas and the burritos. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so what kind of fish are we using? This is mahi mahi. Okay. Scallops and shrimp. Okay. So what we what we have to do is um, chop it. Okay. In little uh, little pieces. And this is uncooked fish, but as Paolo mentioned, the lime juice and the salt and some of the other ingredients are going to actually cook it and give it some great flavor. Once you add the lime juice, you need to let it marinate for at least twelve hours. Okay. So overnight in the fridge at least. Overnight in the fridge, and that will be the best. Uh, uh, it will cook it. I mean, after 12 hours, you don't have to be worried about nothing cooked or, or you eating raw fish or okay. seafood. Okay. Uh, now, if you didn't use mahi mahi, what would be another white fish? That you, you can could use white tilapia, cod, any kind of fish. Okay. Uh, and any and you can any any you can add any kind of uh, seafood. Okay. You know, I mean, we this is what we do: uh, the shrimp, the scallops, and the and the and the fish. Mm -hmm. uh, people add. Uh, you can add lobster, you can add crab, sure, sure. anything. Okay. Uh, ceviche is, in, in different parts of Mexico or Latin America, everybody adds more or takes sure. some stuff away. They and have their own little recipe. They have yeah. their own yeah. recipe, yeah. and they are, and it's still called ceviche, so. Right. So. So chop up your seafood in pretty little pieces so they can go on a chip or a cracker. Right. Okay. It's really fun to do. Really? Actually, this time of year, if you can't get to Mexico, it's kind of their own little party, right? Right. Lime juice, lots of lime juice. Lots of lime juice. So, the juice of a, at least what a couple of limes. I will yes. And and in the recipe that I gave you is is for six people. Okay. So at least use use three whole limes. Okay. And fresh, fresh lime juice. Fresh limes. Yeah, you can tell yeah, the difference. Yeah, you really can. <gasps> oh, sorry. No, you're fine. <laughs> Getting lime juice facial. It's all good. Okay. All right. So we got our lime juice. And and we'll just mix it. All right. All of this mixed. Okay. Smells wonderful. That little onion. Now we can pretend that 12 hours oh, went okay, by. Okay. Because we Cover won't take into the refrigerator hours. 12 hours. 12 okay. hours. And then is when you add the rest of the ingredients. Then you add okay, the, you the don't ingredients. Just the lime juice, any salt? When, at, at everything after. Everything the 12 after. Hours. Okay, so it's, so it's the next day. This has been marinated. It now has cooked the seafood. Uh, yep. And we're ready to start adding. So onion. Onion. Finely diced. Yes. The tomato. Okay. Again, very finely diced. Uh, jalapeno peppers, mm -hmm. up to you. Mm -hmm. You want to or you don't want I to? I do. Throw them in there. I like it spicy. Uh, cilantro. Mm -hmm. I love, love cilantro, too. A little bit of salt. Salt. Okay. Garlic powder. Okay. And what's this last ingredient? Ketchup. A little bit of ketchup. It gives a little bit of ketchup, not too much. gives it a little sweet flavor. And we mix it. Oh, that looks and good. after that, it should be ready to eat. Mm, and we've got it all presented here, a little avocado sliced on top, a little lime wedge for squeezing a little extra lime juice. Um, and again, uh, if you want to try ceviche, you've never tried it or you just, you've had it before and you've been 
uh, craving it. You can get it all the time at Fajita Republic. What are you doing for Valentine's Day? You have some special things going on? We have a special. We have, uh, we have live music and uh, we have... Uh, on Thursday? On Thursday. Okay. Thursday night. Okay. And then we also have a, a $30 special, two margaritas, an appetizer, dinner for two, and a dessert. Can't beat that. Wow. Wow. Deal, $30. And also, you check uh, in our Facebook page, you can print out a coupon for that day. Um, you spend $40 and get $10 off. Oh, wow. So, so how do we find you on Facebook? Uh, Fajita Republic. Okay, all right. Yeah. Paula's going to stick around. What are we making next time? Uh, camarones and salsa de ajo. So Ooh. garlic, in, uh, shrimp and garlic sauce. Sounds good to me. Can't good. wait. All right, we'll be back. Stay with us.